To access the Career Cruising website, uh, visit the website that we provided you. Enter in our college ID, which is LLCC5250, and the password that was provided to you in, uh, in your course. Once you click the sign in, you'll be granted access to this particular resource. Now, you can actually create your own account within this service. You don't have to if you're just using it to browse around. But if you're interested in actually taking some of the career assessments, uh, you may be interested in creating an account. You can do that by uh, selecting my account and creating one for yourself. The way this particular resource works is very similar to the Bureau of Labor Statistics Out Occupational Outlook Handbook. It does have some unique features that I'll highlight along the way. So in general, what you can do is you can explore your interests, you can learn about various careers, and you can also, up at the top right-hand corner, you can search for your particular occupation. So if I'm interested in accounting, I can type in that particular uh, career, and it will give me uh, both an entry for accountant, but also other related occupations like bookkeeper, actuary, auditor, forensic accountant. And I can take a look at those individually, and it will give me more details about that particular career. The way this is organized is to the left-hand side, you have a navigation table of contents. So it'll give you information about the job, uh, working conditions. And again, this is all very similar to the Bureau of uh, Labor Statistics Occupational Outlook Handbook. They'll have description, working conditions, earnings, uh, education. So what it takes to become, uh, in this particular case, an accountant. A sample career path, which is a very nice added feature to this particular resource. It'll show you some examples of how you may become uh, a certified accountant. And then it has some related careers, other resources. The other thing that's unique to this particular uh, resource is that it has an interview, typically with two people, and they'll ask questions about the career, their daily life in that occupation, and what they like and dislike about the job. As you notice on this first landing page, you'll see uh, some images, in this case of a, a gentleman who's uh, doing accounting at his desk, uh, looking at various books, et cetera. And you'll see to the right, they have earning ranges and level of education. Now, those earning ranges are going to be pretty wide. That's because uh, of experience and uh, various levels of education will make that career earning uh, differ, depending on where you are in the country, that type of thing. So it's a pretty broad earnings range. You can click on that and learn more about the earning range uh, just if, you, if you'd like to get more details. This takes a four-year college or university uh, education and then you can find out if it's suitable for you. That will talk about your particular skill set and your traits and how it might fit with this job. You know, Are the hours long? Are there busy times of the year? Do you have to work nights or weekends? Um, is it good for people who have children or don't? That type of thing. So if you scroll down, you'll see it has some core tasks about the job, and then again, various attributes and abilities that may be good uh, for you to have in order to enter this particular field. And they'll describe the workplace. So, you know, many travel uh, frequently to clients' offices or places of business. If you don't, it seems like the type of job where you might be stuck in an office, but it could be that you'll have to go out and visit other people, uh, maybe in their homes or in their businesses, and that might get you out of the office a little bit. If you want to look at any of these particular uh, subcategories in more detail, you can click on that. Uh, option to the left in the table of contents, and we'll talk about the earnings again in a little bit more detail. They'll focus in on Illinois as well, so you'll have a better a better idea or a better sense of what uh, this particular region of the country uh, looks like in terms of earnings, etc. And then they'll talk about employment numbers and whether they're going up or down, and what percentage of increase uh, that was. Again, the interviews are particularly interesting. In this case, let's take a look at Jack here. Questions and answers, things like uh, day in the life, what's your job uh, sort of like on a, a daily basis? Can you tell me about your background and how you got into the field? Personal characteristics, job security, all of these things are going to inform you about your selection of this career and whether or not you have what it takes to uh, enter this particular profession. That's a general overview of this particular resource. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to uh, Lincoln Land. Librarian, we're always here to help. Take care.